Hi guys, I'm Louise and welcome to my YouTube channel. So in today's video I'm doing a get ready with me plant edition. So the first thing I do in the morning is I put plants that need to go on the windowsill on the windowsill and I move all the other plants that um, are not very close to sunlight just to bring them forwards and um, over to different shelves just so they get their lights. Um, so yeah, let's get to it. Alright guys, just so you can see, um, probably because that uh, time lapse is just a tiny bit too dark, um, but I didn't realise that until after um, videoing it, but I've got my little bonsai kit here with my juniper, and I have all my baby bonsais up here. I have my Tradescantia, my Zebrina, and all my propagations, and yeah, so that's my windowsill. Now, as you guys are all wondering where all my other plants are, they're kept over here. So I've got all my succulents, I've got my stingray, I've got succulent, another succulent, I mean, um, I've got another propagation. The only reason why I don't put her on the windowsill is because um, the animals will drink the water and the, well, we've got quite a big dog, so she will gulp the whole thing down. She's drank out of my water before and it's gone everywhere. Um, I've put my polka dot begonia down here. Um, I've, I know that she can't have direct light, so indirect light is the best place. And all along here, everybody gets lights. Um, I have my, my red polka dot plant, got my baby string of beads, my pitcher plants. Um, the reason why I don't, I don't always put my pitcher plant on the windowsill, only because it can get quite cold. I know it doesn't really like cold climates as much, um, I think, if I got that right. Don't come at me, I'm actually, I am not an expert. Um, and I just got all my, my cacti and succulents. And then I've got my two training plants. I've got my string of tears and my string of hearts. So I don't um, usually put a makeup, but as I'm going out today, I will um, open mics to start, well, reopening back up slowly, gigs are starting to happen, and I'm a musician, so I am going to an open mic today, which is so, so um, nice. I'm actually really excited. Um, it's been months and I haven't seen anybody, so that is really, 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 really exciting for me. So as far as makeup goes, I don't really wear much, um, only really wear eyeshadow and mascara and then I just put like a clear eyebrow gel on just so, um, just to keep my eyebrows in place basically. So yeah, so I am using the e.l.f. Um, eye, eyeshadow primer, so just put that on my eyelids. I have just got a mirror right here just to um, just see what I'm doing. I'm doing them both eyes. that's that got the primer on and then I am gonna do a blue look today so I've got my revolution um, shadow palettes I really like revolution really love um, the colors um, quite vibrant um, I'm not professional these this is not sponsored not sponsored by anybody I'm just kind of showing you my makeup routine because seeing plants is great but that's like pretty much all I do um, in the morning and it's just my routine. Um, so yeah, 
because I'm going out today and putting makeup on so I'm gonna add that too as today is what my routine is basically so I'm gonna do two colors and I'm just gonna pack on a really light blue to start off with And then I then go in with a, a darker blue. So I've got my light blue down. And I'm just gonna go in with a, a lighter blue. If I can find a really, a darker blue, I mean. A darker blue, because you can't go any lighter than this. Just really nice dark blue. Oh yeah, if you wanna, um, you know, if you like this look and you have this palette, um, I'm using this light blue to start off with and then this darker blue just to finish with. Um, so yeah, I'll just put the darker blue in the crease. And that just really finishes off my look. With the eyeshadow at least, anyway. <laughs> So that is my eyeshadow done. Just gonna quick check from here just to make sure I've got everything. That looks good. And now I am going to be putting on um, just a. This was from um, Primark, I think. So this is just a PS Smoky Lash um, mascara long lasting so it works and I just curl my lashes and then put them on I don't even think this does anything but the only reason why I'm not curling my lashes before, like after I put mascara because that's not what you do but um yeah I kind of it kind of makes sense if you put it if you like curl your lashes after putting on mascara because then like you know I don't know so, curl my lashes. And now the last thing, I am just using a clear brow gel, Model Co. Um, this is, I think this, I think I got this, I was using a, a makeup subscription box and I got a few things on it. So yeah, dog, dog hair in my wand. So I'm just kind of, Shaping my eyebrow, making sure it's in its right shape before, before putting on the gel because otherwise it doesn't go very well. And then simply just putting the ones through my eyebrow hairs and basically done. So that is it, um, here's my look, get closer in. So yeah, so that is basically all I do, my routine, so thank you guys for watching, this was my daily routine plant edition plus makeup routine as I'm going out today. So please subscribe, like, um, and just, yeah. I hope you guys have a good day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.